Okay, so we got a 2007 Grand Marquis. Uh, customer want us to change the fluid and filter on this. We already started pulling the fan down. Uh, this car is only supposed to have 65,000 miles on it, never been changed. Fluid smells like it's never been changed. It's clean, but it just uh, smells like that full of fluid. Um, if it's true that it hasn't been changed, then there should be a little yellow plunger in the pan. Um, they put that in the uh, where the filler tube goes when they run it through the factory. They pop that down into the pan and, uh, and, and just move on with it. But uh, instead of pulling the pan back down and getting it out there, they just leave it in. So we're going to check this out, see if that, uh, see if that little plunger is in there. Uh, this is on the, yep, there it is. If you see that in your pan, don't get excited. It's supposed to be in there from the factory. That means your fluid's never been changed. So we're going to pull this one out so the next guy will know that, uh, that the fluid has been changed. Uh, we're going to drop the filter down on this and put a new filter on it. The, um, the type fluid that we're putting back in it is Max Life, and, um, and that's what the customer brought. That's what I told him that I like to use. It's compatible with the, uh, with the LV fluids, the Mercon LV, so you know it's a good fluid for this transmission. This is a 4R70W, and, um, and we're going to uh, get this fluid changed. We're going to let it drain down for a little bit, and then we're going to get this filter back on and pan back up against it. Uh, guys, this comes with a reusable gasket. I'm just going to let you know if that gasket wasn't leaking when you tuck it off, if you didn't damage it or anything, I just put the reusable back on it. Uh, I have too many customers come in here where they change the fluid themselves and they put the uh, the new gasket it comes with their transmissions, um, you know, filter kits and and those gaskets they 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 just don't hold up as good as the reusable gasket. So, but anyway, we're gonna cut this off, let this transmission drain down for just a little bit, and uh, and then we're gonna put the filter back on it. Okay, so we got the uh, the fluid drained down pretty good. Uh, I just want to show y'all, you see the orange seal on the end of that filter and the old one is still stuck up in the transmission. So you don't want to make that mistake and cause yourself some problems. Make sure that you get that old seal out of that transmission uh, so that your new filter can go all the way up in there. Uh, the new filter, I do have a link below on what this project might cost you. Uh, you can click on that and, and just kind of check it out. Um, also, uh, please subscribe and, you know, I hope this video helped you.